This is a devotional, that is, time you set aside to be with God. Repentance Imperative, Acts chapter 2, verses 31a47. Peter replied, Repent, and let each of you be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, for the forgiveness of your sins, and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit, verse 38. The Holy Spirit works in us. Through preaching or simply reading the Bible and convinces us of sin, justice and judgment, producing repentance, which means metanoia, changing the way of thinking. Making us recognize that we are sinners lost and leading us to Christ to be saved. True repentance is the result of divine supernatural action, producing regeneration or the new birth. Indispensable for salvation. Luke chapter 13 verses 3 and 5. John chapter 3 verses 3a6. Titus chapter 3 verses 5e6. There is a transformation in life. There are people who claim to be saved, but show no evidence, continuing to live the same way as always. For them, regret is a feeling. This is remorse and remorse is not regret. We must examine ourselves to be sure that our sins are forgiven and to conduct ourselves according to God's will. Another type of repentance is that of sins committed after being saved, which we must immediately confess to the Lord, 1 John chapter 1, verses 5a10. There is great joy in heaven when a sinner repents. Luke chapter 15, verse 7. When Jesus left, he promised to send the Holy Spirit to his disciples. They did not know what it would be like, but from that moment on they began to feel something very special in their hearts. As if Jesus were there very close to them. You can also feel the Holy Spirit in your heart. And every time you choose to answer your voice, you will be happier. Source. Menantial. Website. HTTPS colon slash slash www.ufmbb.org.br Video. Carlos Rodriguez Coelho. Disseminator of the Gospel of Jesus. Website. HTTPS colon slash slash antigo dash novo dash testamento dot net. Open your heart. You are a sinner. Jesus suffered for you on the cross paying the penalty instead. Died was buried without sin. If you accept this in your life and confess with your vocation to Jesus as Lord and Savior you will be saved. Romans chapter 10 verse 9 If you want to be saved and be part of the church of Jesus. Say it now with faith, I accept Jesus Christ like my Lord Savior. You are sealed with the Holy Spirit Ephesians chapter 1 verses 13 to 14. The nutrients for your soul and his spirit are loving God above all things and love your neighbor like yourself. Matthew chapter 22 verse 27 to 29.